Hello, this is the fourth video of our weekly Marin Schools Together series. We are sending these videos to update families on how to safely start the school year. In today's video, we will share important topics about the start of school, including start dates and district efforts to make sure that every child has a Chromebook and Wi-Fi connection. As a reminder, school will start this year with distance learning. All students will be learning from home using a computer or Chromebook. We will share school start dates for each district at the end of this video. Please view the previous videos for ways to help your child be successful in distance learning. All students in Marin County need a computer or Chromebook and access to the internet to learn this year. Every child's school is responsible for making sure that each student has access to both a Chromebook and Wi-Fi internet. If your child does not have their own computer, meaning they have access to the device 100% of the time, please reach out to your school to pick up a Chromebook. Every district is currently working to get devices out to every student. If your family lives in San Rafael, you can pick up a Chromebook from Monday, August 17th to Wednesday, August 19th from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. at Bahia Vista School or Davidson Middle School. All high school students can pick up a Chromebook on Wednesday, August 19th from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. at San Rafael High School near the back gym. If you have children at different schools, you are able to pick up devices for all of your children at one location and one time. Please just tell staff that you have multiple children in San Rafael City Schools. If your family lives in Novato, devices were distributed last week and some are being distributed this week. If your children did not yet receive a Chromebook, please call the School of the Help Desk at 415 493-4299. If your family lives in the Shoreline District, devices will be delivered directly to you. Please call 707-878-2225 if you have not received a Chromebook for your children. Districts will be calling families to tell them about the school schedule that starts next week. Districts will let you know who your child's teacher is and the schedule your child should be following. Remember, Learning happens over Zoom. It is not a recording, so all students should be learning from approximately 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Attendance is being recorded and students must be on the computer to get attendance credit. If you have not received information about your children's schedule, please call your school. School lunches and breakfasts will continue to be provided by each school district. Novato is distributing meals Monday through Friday at the following locations and times. Hill Education Center, 720 Diablo Avenue, from 11.30 a.m. to 1 p.m. Hamilton School, 5530 Nave Drive, 11.30 to 1 p.m. Linwood Elementary, 1320 Linwood Drive, from 11.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. Olive School Area, 1530 Armstrong Avenue, 11.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. San Rafael City Schools is distributing meals Monday through Friday at Bahia Vista School, 125 Bahia Vista, San Rafael, from 10.45 a.m. to 12.15 p.m. Now we will answer some questions that parents texted us after watching the first three videos. Please use our text line if you have questions. You can text 415 596-9107. Here's a question that we just received. If my child already has a laptop, do they also need a Chromebook or will the laptop work for online classes? If your child already has a computer or laptop, they may use it as long as your child is able to access the applications that they may need like Zoom, Canvas, Google Classrooms, etc. Please contact your school for this information as there are different applications for each school depending on grade level. The Wi-Fi internet is weak where we live. What should we do if our internet is not strong enough for online classes? 
Please contact your school and let them know your Wi-Fi internet is weak. They can loan you a hotspot that will provide stronger Wi-Fi internet connection or help get you connected to a stronger Wi-Fi. Thank you to all the parents who texted questions. Please continue to do so. For any questions that are specific to your child or to a specific school, we are working to text you back directly. We will answer questions that could apply to multiple students directly in our videos. Remember, all classes will begin online. To get off the state watch list and bring students back to school, we must reduce the number of COVID cases in Marin to less than 19 new cases per day for 14 consecutive days. Right now, we have approximately 24 cases per day. You can help slow the spread of COVID-19 by wearing a face mask, practicing social distancing, washing hands as often as possible, staying home and isolated from other people if you are feeling sick, which is very important, getting tested if you have any of the symptoms such as fever, cough, chills, etc. Thank you for doing your part to help slow the spread of COVID-19 in our community. We are in this together. We can do this. We are Marin Schools together. Thank you. You can always text us for your school's contact information at 415-596-9107. On August 17th, school starts for Novato Charter School. August 19th, Larkspur Corta Madera, Nicasio, Ross Valley Charter, Ross Valley, and Tamalpais Union High School District. August 20th, Marin County Office of Education, Novato Unified, Santa Fe City Schools, and Ross. August 24th, Lagunitas, Miller Creek, Mill Valley, Reed Union, and Shoreline Unified. August 25th, Kentfield. August 26th, Willow Creek Academy. August 31st, Bolinas Stinson Union. September 8th, Bayside MLK.